Two at six, Patrick Kennedy continues his campaign for support for brain research. Former congressman is trying to help heal and get rid of the stigma attached to mental health disorders. He's chosen a violent case to highlight the importance of recognition and treatment. Jared Loeffner, the man accused of shooting Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords and killing six others. Highway to Sioux reporter Catherine Sotnik joins us now with the details live from the mobile newsroom. Well, Mike, in a recent interview, former Rep. Patrick Kennedy was trying to make a point that people with mental health issues have been ignored for too long, but not all of the people saw his point as he saw it. In, order to get, in the CNN uh, interview titled Patrick Kennedy Coming Clean, former Rhode Island Representative Patrick Kennedy implies that he has sympathy for Jared Lee Loeffner. He is the alleged shooter in the Tucson rampage that injured Representative Gabrielle Giffords and killed a half dozen others. It's an irony, but we think nothing of no stigma towards Gabby and her brain injury, but he has a brain injury as well because clearly his brain was not working properly when he picked up that gun and shot all those people. Kennedy has struggled with substance abuse for more than 25 years. He says mental instabilities are often dismissed by the public. There is that sense like Jared Loeffner out in Arizona. He's crazy. They look the other way. Not thinking that this is someone who's sick and needs health care. Instead, because we look the other way and he goes untreated, he shoots and kills people, including a good friend of mine, Gabby Giffords. And at this point, Kennedy does not have an official spokesperson, but we did put several calls into a longtime Kennedy chief of staff and a family friend. Our calls were not returned. Reporting live tonight with the Mobile Newsroom, I'm Katherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.